a light string passing over a smooth light pulley connected two blocks masses m1 and m2 where m2 is greater than m1 if the acceleration of the system is g by square root of 2 then the ratio of the masses m1 by m2 is the given question is atwood's mission let us take a smooth pulley with the help of a string two masses are connected on both sides of the pulley but mass m2 is greater than m1 let us take left side m1 and right side m2 mass of the second block is greater than the mass of the first block so second block is accelerating in downward direction weight of this block is acting in downward direction that is m2g and tensional force in upward direction and the resultant force in downward direction m1 weight acting in downward direction tensional force upward direction and resultant acceleration in upward direction take m1 this is the direction of the tensional force and this is the direction of the weight of the block and acceleration in upward direction mass of the block is less so tensional force is greater than the weight t minus m1 g is equals to m1 a and take the second block m2 here weight is greater than tensional force so resultant acceleration in downward direction m2 g minus t is equals to m2 a here we know t is equals to m1 g plus m1 a here on both sides string is same so tensional force also same m2 g is equals to m1 g plus m1 a plus m2 a take acceleration common a into m1 plus m2 and now here take this term to LHS side and take G common G into M2 minus M1. Then acceleration is equals to G into M2 minus M1 by M1 plus M2. When you know this formula directly take to calculate the acceleration. Difference of weights of the system by sum of the masses. In this question we have to find out the ratio of the masses and we know the value of the acceleration. In place of A substitute G by square root of 2. Here G into M2 minus M1 by M1 plus M2. A cross multiplication M1 plus M2 root 2 into M2 minus M1 so root 2 M2 minus square root of 2 into m1 take this minus term to lhs side m1 plus root 2 m1 is equals to root 2 m2 minus m2 m1 common 1 plus root 2 and here m2 common m2 into root 2 minus 1 we want the ratio of m1 by m2 m1 by m2 is equals to root 2 minus 1 by root 2 plus 1. This is the ratio of the masses of the system. m1 by m2 is equals to square root of 2 minus 1 by square root of 2 plus 1. First option is correct.